Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to update your PlayStation 4 using a USB flash drive. So let's go ahead and jump into this PlayStation tutorial right now. So I'm on the home screen of my PlayStation 4. The first thing I'm going to do is press the PlayStation button on the controller and pop open the sidebar and then scroll down to power and completely turn off my PlayStation 4. Do not go to rest mode and do not go to restart. Completely turn off your PlayStation 4 so we can go ahead and restart our PlayStation 4 into safe mode later on in the video. So once your PlayStation 4 is turned off, go ahead and go over to the computer. Now let's open up a web browser on our computer and go to google.com. And then we're gonna type in the search bar here PS4 system software and then press enter and it will be the first link right above here it will be on playstation.com PS4 system software update your PS4 let's go ahead and click on this link and then it's going to bring us to the PS4 system software update page and the current version is 6.72 and let's scroll down about halfway on this page and we are going to want to download the update PS4 system software using USB file right here and this one will be about 460 megabytes. Do not go to the reinstall PS4 system software that will be for reinstalling your software we just want to update it so go to update make sure it's highlighted blue and then go to download PS4 system software and select that. And it's going to download on the bottom left hand side of the screen. If it does not show up here, go to the three dots in the upper right hand side of the screen, select those, and then go to downloads. And it will bring you to this page where you can see it downloading. And when it finishes, you can go to show in folder and view where it is. So now that that is downloading, let's go ahead and plug in our USB stick into our computer right now. And then go down to File Explorer and select that. Now that we have File Explorer open, let's locate our USB flash drive on the left hand side. Mine is Drive 1 under the H drive. I'm going to go ahead and right click on it. And we are going to need to format this drive. So go to Format. And then make sure it's on FAT32, FAT32. And then go down to Start. And it's going to erase everything on your USB flash drive. So just a heads up, if you have anything on your flash drive you want, go ahead and move it over to your PC. Let's go ahead and press OK. And it's already done formatting, so great. Now let's close this and open up File Explorer once again. Go back to our USB flash drive. Now right click when you're inside the flash drive, go to New slash Folder, all capitals, type in PS4. Then select the PS4 and go into that folder. Go to right click, go down to new, go to folder, all capitals, update. So once we have that completed, it says update. Once we go into here, we're going to want to copy and paste that download into here. So let's go ahead and bring that open. And I see it's completed downloading. I'm going to go to show in folder. I'm going to highlight the update file, right click on it, and then go down to copy. Then I'm going to go over to my file explorer where I have my PS4 folder. And then I'm going to go into the update folder. Right click into this folder and then go down to paste. And it is copying over to the update folder inside my flash drive. Okay, so now that's complete. Let's go ahead and remove my USB flash drive from my computer by going to it on the left hand side. Right clicking on it and then going to eject. And now you can safely remove it from your PC. So let's remove it right now. Now let's go ahead and plug in our USB stick on our PlayStation 4. I have a USB hub that I'm just gonna go ahead and plug in. And it's a little bit easier sometimes with USB sticks. This little groove right here on the PlayStation 4, it sometimes cannot fit in here. So I'm just gonna plug it into here. Now our console is completely turned off. There is no lights on it right now. Let's go ahead and hold down the power button and keep holding it down for 10 seconds until the PlayStation 4 beeps a second time and then let go. So it beeped a second time and it is now launching our PlayStation 4 into safe mode. Let's jump over to my screen here and go to the update setting. Okay, so now we're in the safe mode menu. Let's go ahead and connect a controller with a USB cable and then press the PlayStation button. And then let's go down to number three 
update system software and select that. And then let's go to number one, update from USB storage device. Let's go ahead and select that option. Then connect a USB storage device that contains an update file version 6.72 or later. You can download the update from playstation.com. Let's go ahead and select OK. And it will update your PlayStation 4. So hopefully this video on how to update your PlayStation 4 system software helped you out using a USB stick. If it did, please leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation help videos coming up next on your six studios.